Imagine being able to hand your employees a tablet that allows them to train on any piece of equipment on your manufacturing floor, or providing a new hire with an interactive map of your campus on their first day. With augmented reality, the opportunities are limitless when it comes to interactive training. But before investing in an advanced technology like augmented reality, it may be helpful to gain a deeper understanding of the three AR technologies. And that's what we'll do today, so stay tuned. Hi there, my name is Joe DeLugas and I'm an account executive with Roundtable Learning. We've built augmented reality training programs for organizations across the US. One of the first steps to any AR training is deciding what kind of technology is best for you. And that's why we made this video to talk about how AR can transform your training program into review to big three AR technologies. Augmented reality is a great tool when you're training on products or equipment. Examples of this include technicians studying a new engine or cashiers learning a new point of sale system. When used as part of a blended learning program, AR can help reinforce learning objectives with interactive and engaging activities. We also recommend augmented reality to our clients that are looking for on-the-job performance support tools for their employees. Since an augmented reality program can be used on location through a mobile device, your employees can have access to videos, instructions, and other learning materials while they are working from any location. Image recognition uses an app where learners can scan real-world images, such as a poster, and overlay video, text, pictures, or 3D objects on it. Image recognition is a marker-based technology. With a mobile device or tablet, learners can scan a static marker such as a QR code and anchor preloaded digital content on top of it. This content can be easily reprogrammed while keeping the same real-world marker. For example, as part of an onboarding program, a learner could use their tablet to scan a poster in front of them to bring up a video about the organization's history, culture, and values. Object recognition builds interactive experiences by attaching a 3D object to an existing real-life object. Through the camera of a mobile device, the AR software recognizes the real-life object then places the digital model accordingly. Once complete, learners can interact with and manipulate the 3D digital object. For example, a mechanic could use object recognition to learn how to repair a car's AC compressor. After scanning a real-world compressor, the mechanic in training can attach a digital 3D model to the compressor and learn how to safely disassemble and reassemble it. The most popular AR technology is plane detection, which places a digital 3D model on a real-world flat surface like a tabletop or floor. By simply pointing their device toward a surface in front of them, learners can produce a full-scale model of an object that they can then walk around, inspect, and manipulate. Once the object is placed, learners can rotate it, break it apart, and get detailed information on how to repair or install the object. For example, learners can practice training on an engine by scanning it to a surface with their tablet and anchoring a digital model of an engine to it. They can then adjust the engine however they'd like by rotating it, resizing it, or raising or lowering its placement. Once placed, learners can interact with the engine by selecting certain parts and watching video tutorials on how to assemble it. And that covers augmented reality technologies. Hopefully this helps you imagine how you can use augmented reality for your training program. For more details, you can read the full article on roundtablelearning.com. To learn more about AR training, our article about five ways AR can save your organization money is linked in the description below. If you have any questions, reach out to us anytime and make sure to like this video and subscribe for all things training and development.